when you are looking for a 3D printer and it crossed your mind to use AliExpress as provider of your 3D printer, you can, but you have to be careful. Coming up on Zachary 3D Print. Hello, this is Zachary from Zachary 3D Prints, bringing you how to reviews and many other cool things you can do with 3D printing. If you are new to this channel and not subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. I also have some social media links in the description of this video, and you can also support my channel on Patreon. Like the other ones, I'm going to put the link in the description. Thanks for your support. Like I mentioned in the intro, I'm going to talk about AliExpress. Why? Because sometimes when I have some time, I'm going through my phone and I'm checking some new things I can buy on AliExpress. But you have to be careful. Why? Because AliExpress show sometimes prices that are not really true because aliexpress ships internationally and uh, worldwide so for me as a dutch citizen of the netherlands i can buy something on aliexpress it starts with a very good and almost too good to be true price and that's just it it sounds too good to be true because there are some price ranges so if you are close to china or you're in the region of of china and you buy something on aliexpress for sending to you then the prices can be very very good but it, if in my case i'm ordering something on aliexpress i have to go through some menu i'm going to show you some different kind of prices and I hope I will find some good examples. Let's go to AliExpress. So let's find the first victim of this price range difference. Because on AliExpress you have very cheap 3D printers like the CTC printer or the other D EY kit and you also have some other printers and if I'm scrolling the first one that I, I find is the Sapphire S it's a 3d printer with an enclosure I'm going to open it and um, there I am again and as you can see the price is between the 85 and a $409. Now I'm going to say like, let's like check his Republic and the Sapphire S1 and we take as plug we take European Union. My price of this same $85 costing printer $322. So the same printer where I thought it was below the hundred dollars is now three hundred and twenty-two dollars. Here it's also is written auto shield acrylic. So when you are buying something from AliExpress, make sure that everything in the advertisement is clear to you so that you don't make any mistakes and that you're buying a 3d printer where you thought it cost 100 or 200 euro dollars that you don't buy something like five or six hundred dollars we take one other example 
you close this one we go to another one here you also have one in a net a8 3d printer and well they ship from china czech republic germany italy france and spain the price range is between the 93 and the 214 dollars well for me as a citizen from the netherlands i will take germany as closest by one and then they say cannot deliver to the netherlands well we take then spain free shipping to the netherlands via seller's shipping method so now we take as color a6 i don't know if a6 is a color and now my price at aliexpress is 140 dollars so sometimes there is no shipping information between one country and your place so you also need to take attention to that specific uh, part of ordering something from aliexpress we take one other example one thing that i also saw uh, i i saw a very nice and decent printer of anet which is also something that i see here this is going to be very <laughs> very um catchy because the price of this aluminium 3d printer of anet it looks like it's a official design of anet i don't see any familiar things so let's go to shipping from spain and you see that under color that you have different kind of ones we take for example china this is a different one as this one so i'm at the advertisement of a aluminium 3d printer with molded plastic parts but then if i take this one that is a scholar it's a i3 design it's a different kind of 3d printer which is yeah strange so but just order one take spain then i don't have the first option i here have this one a fully diy a8 plus this one cost $180 but if I look to the parts I hope I can see that full clearly you see the aluminium struts here I see the glass bed I see the model this is the aluminium version it's not the one that I just selected the A8 but this is a different one you can also uh, order the semi DIY A8 plus version but then it cost $200 For, to, to my opinion I think it's a very good thing that uh, they have some, some variable prices but then put them in a different category and not if you are saying you can order this one for $100 but then if you select your settings your wishes on this order that you are paying more than hundred dollars so in case of the china and we take the a8 uh, i3 version you pay 190 euros but free shipping how's that for a change here on the right side i see also the one recommended for you and you see different kind of models with different kind of prices the price that i'm going to pay for this if i would order this is hundred dollars more than here on the left i think it's very funny so that is something you have to be aware of when ordering something on aliexpress 
Let's see if I got a third victim here. Um, do I have some other one here? This one, I have to admit, two trees. Well done. This is US dollars 102 till 110 dollars. You see that this is specifically the acrylic shell. It's not the printer, it's just the shell for around your 3D printer. So that is a very good thing. But not advertising the printer for this price and then it's going about the acrylic shell that should go around it. Do I see something else? I also saw some Delta printers with the same thing. I, I thought it was $109. And it was eventually $219. So it's a huge difference. Here you have the, the Delta 3D printer, $116 versus uh, uh, $282. Here we are going, also going to do the same. Well, the closest place I would say it's France, but France usually don't have, oh well, it does now but $255 for the printer. I don't have to select if it is an European Union plug for that. It's cool, it's nice. But then you also pay $255 for this printer. So, so that was it for today's video. If you are ordering something from AliExpress, please be careful, check out the price for the things that you want to have, check where it's shipped from, and then enjoy the rest of the AliExpress experience. I don't have that much problems with it, but I do want to mention it to warn other people. That being said, thanks for watching. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you next time. Happy 3D printing, Sakuri 3D Prints, Bye-bye.